a fascinating discussion about a controversial diet that has everybody asking, how can I get on it? Imagine losing a pound a day, but never feeling hungry. It's called the HCG diet. You take a hormone called HCG while on a diet that's very low in calories. Now, it sounds too good to be true, but you're going to meet some people, including doctors, who've tried it and say it has changed their lives. Now, all these people over here say they have lost an amazing amount of weight on it, about 800 pounds in total. And when I first heard about it, I was intrigued, but I had a lot of questions. Does it really work? Is it safe? Is it a miracle or is it hype? It's the hottest diet sweeping the country. And if you believe all the hype, it's the long awaited miracle cure for weight loss. Imagine losing 40 pounds in just 40 days. An astonishing one pound per day. That's what the ads promise for the HCG diet. It's controversial, and thousands of people swear by it. The HCG diet actually dates back to the 1950s, when Dr. A.T.W. Simeons claimed that human chorionic gonadotropin, a hormone produced during pregnancy to ensure a fetus gets necessary nutrients, could also promote weight loss. How? According to Simeons, by simultaneously suppressing your appetite while helping your body burn fat. Users say that helps them with the most radical part of the diet, which limits you to just 500 calories a day. Why be so dramatic? Why not allow 1,000 calories or 1,200? That still is enough to lose weight. Well, what we're seeing today with obesity, it's becoming an epidemic. And the sooner we can get people to their goals where they are healthy, the better off they are. Explain why that's possible. How, how can you live on 500 calories a day? You're actually not living off of just this food. What the concept is and why it works so well is you're living off of this food that you're consuming, plus the additional body fat needed for the energy you're not consuming. So let me underline that if I can. So you're saying that the reason that HCG is effective is because you can get by with 500 calories because you're burning fat stores, of right. which most of us have tens of thousands of calories just on our hips alone. What's your first name? Lisa. Lisa, talk to me about your experience. Have you been hungry on it? Is it difficult? Um, the first two days, maybe I was a little bit hungry. And then um, I had a lot of greens, as Dr. Emma said. It did fill me up. Drank a lot of water. And I definitely had a lot more energy. I felt a lot better. It came off quickly, and I've kept it off. And how much is it? How much weight did you lose? 15 pounds. 15 pounds. Perfect. And you were on for how many weeks? Uh, I was on it for three weeks. Three weeks. Okay. Now, you had a question. Go ahead. Pass that over here, if you don't mind. Stan, if you don't mind, introduce yourself. I'm Mary Jo, and I'm from New Jersey. And this diet is amazing. I tried every national known diet. Five months on one, I lost one pound. I found Dr. Emma, and in about a six-week period, I dropped about... 30 pounds, just shy of 30 pounds. 30 pounds. I, yeah, I'm very happy. Right, so, so nothing that of this extreme nature, in my opinion, could be without some side effects. Any complications, any nausea, headaches? Everyone loved it. No. I, was, I was having severe headaches for, I think it coincided with the weight that I was carrying, and my headaches went away. When I'm taking the HCG, they're gone. What, what made you try the HCG diet in the first place, as opposed to all the other the myriad of diet options out there? So I needed to lose weight because I had gotten to the point where I felt, and I know a lot of the ladies probably understand this, started feeling my biggest jeans that I've ever had get so tight where I refuse to buy an extra size of jeans, like an extra pair, just going up a size. I said, I'm not going to do that. I'm a part of the media. And people see me, and I want to look good, and I think that I could be fabulous. So here's a picture of Nina before you went on the program, I understand. Yeah. Right, and, and how much have you lost? I've lost 50 pounds, and I've kept it off. I mean, I mean, obviously it shows there's a massive amount of weight to lose. And, and you use the drops, is that correct? These the drops like this? Those are the drops. I use them. I swear by them. They taste like nothing, so mm. don't think, oh, it might taste like something. Um, and uh, you just take them three times a day. So and I was fascinated by Nina's story. So I followed up with Gary, her friend, mm -hmm. the chiropractor, who sells her the homeopathic HCG drops. And Gary is joining us today. Uh, he also lost weight on this plan. Gary, welcome to the show. Thank you, Dr. Oz. How, how much did you lost, by the way? I personally lost 35 pounds in 40 days. These are just crazy men, numbers. Yeah, men you know. seem to lose it a little faster than women. I'm sorry, but uh, <laughs> you know, it seems to be the case. I want you to meet someone that I would never in a million years have thought would try this diet. 
Dr. Sanjeev Patel is a cardiologist, he's a heart doctor, and this shocked me. A heart doctor tried this diet. That's one of the reasons that this diet got a bad name a couple decades ago uh, when it was first being tried widely. He's one of Dr. Emma's patients. So Dr. Patel, thanks for joining us. Thank you very much. Could you just help everybody understand, as a physician, why you thought this diet made sense? And give us a little bit of insight into how it affected you. Well, I'll, I'll tell you. What I think what initially lured me to this were the claims that, you know, you can survive on a 500-calorie uh, day diet. And if this ACG indeed works, it would be a, the magic bullet that will help you get over the hurdle of being hungry. Uh, and and, and I'm sort of weighing the risks and benefits of being obese and dealing with the risks of it, and looking at the low dose of HCG, I thought for myself, I was willing to give that uh, a try. Now by researching HCG, and this is what I'm excited by, we might find new ways to help millions of people who do not have another solution find an option. And for that reason, I think it's worth investigating.